through the fight. Are you happy with that? Yeah, I'm happy. Um, but I, I want to be pushed on now. I need some better opposition. Um, yeah, as you can see, I was in first gear. So, uh, but yeah, I enjoyed it. And the arena and having my family and friends and my fans here is amazing. It was uh, an interesting point you just made there because I said the similar thing to Jordan Thompson who just won in 53 seconds, you know. It, it's difficult, isn't it? And as much as winning the fight is a positive, is it frustrating in some ways that you're not able to yeah. showcase more and learn more under the lights? Yeah, um, Eddie just said then, we've just seen them uh, one more eight rounds and then we're just going to push on into ten, tens and a uh, better opposition, so. And in terms of Capriolo as an opponent, I mean, she, she, she fought as well as she could, but there wasn't an awful lot coming back. Do you feel it was the right call from the referee to stop the fight at that stage? It was more the accumulation of the punishment and the way the, the fight was so, shaping. Because I was going to push on. Uh, I was really going to push on in that round. Um, and then after, she said thanks to the ref. So she was hurt, but she's just tough, like a fighter. She stayed in there. And just talk to me about next year. You, you mentioned it there, but you want the tougher fights, don't you? Because you want the girls who are going to make you think in there. And do you believe when you're in those type of fights, we'll see the very best of Sandy Ryan as well? 100%. When you get a better opposition, more skills will come out of me. Um, you'll see it. You, you'll see it. And following on from Milan, which you know, we always talk about that stoppage, we've described it as medieval. It was, it was phenomenal, really. Another stoppage for you tonight. The name Sandy Ryan is hot on the lips of boxing fans when they're talking about the emerging next female star. How much does that satisfy you? I love it. Um, I, want, I want these big fights and uh, I, want to, I want to put these girls down. I feel like I'm getting my punching power now and uh, they're stinging the shots. When I'm punching them on the head, I can feel it in my knuckles. The eight ounce gloves as well, I love it. And in terms of female boxing, it's certainly not never been in a stronger position than it is now. The, the girls, the talent, it's getting so much stronger from the base of the pyramid right to the very top now. Your first calendar year as a professional in the books, it wasn't a decision you took lightly to turn pro, but looking back now, I'm sure in terms of timing, is it a decision that you're so glad you made? Yeah, the best decision that I could have made. Um, it's put me in a real good place and um, I'm starting to put my name out there now in the pro scene. And it was interesting, I heard Chris Lloyd ask you this question in Milan, you know, despite only being three fights in now, how far away do you believe you are from being in the mix at world level? Put, put me in there right now. <laughs> Whoever's got the titles, put me in there right now. So you'll certainly have one eye then on, on the road to undisputed final. It looks like we're going to see that in the first quarter of 2022. Do you believe it? Do you believe it? You know, I believe in, in, it. In, 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 in a year's time, you could be facing the, the winner of that fight? A year's time, 100%. I believe you have to take the right steps, but I believe I'm good enough. And you can't get in that ring if you don't believe in yourself. Absolutely. And just finally then, for, for your fans who came in here tonight and, and for those who showed their support on the zone, do you have any final messages you'd like to leave for them and perhaps also to the rest of the £140 division who are watching on? Yeah, thank you so much for um, my fan sports friends, family that came to support, brought a ticket, come to Manchester, got a little crowd going then. Um, and yeah, super lightweight division, weightweight division. I love them all. I love any of them, any of them. Anyone can get it. Sandy Ryan, a massive, massive future ahead. Congratulations Thank to you, you and much. enjoy the rest of tonight. Well Thank done. You.